Hi, this is Dwayne Hartman from Lancaster County Marine, Service Manager. Today we're going to take a tour of a Wellcraft Step V20 that's been updated and modernized to make it the great fishing boat without a huge investment. You'll notice that this is sitting on a Shorelander drive-on trailer. It does have the keel roller assist and the rear rollers. However, it has the uh, load guides, so this makes it the perfect trailer to allow it to load and unload uh, in tidal waters. It also sets the boat down lower than most. You'll see that the boat has a lot of bow flare. This is a Florida built Wellcraft, so they know how to build a boat for safety in rough big waters. That bow flare is legendary to make this boat dry. And of course it's got a deep V down under to cut, but uh, that'll knock any spray down here at the chines and keep this boat in rough sea conditions, safe and sturdy. It has a high stainless steel bow rail, uh, so the opening bow hatch and walk through is a unique feature to the Step V20. So uh, this gets a cabin with more room that you can get into and uh, get out of the weather. It does have a nice uh, convertible top, two Todd fishing chairs, nice seats for the captain and co-pilot. But a great feature about this boat is a wide open cockpit because of the stainless marine transom bracket. The extended transom bracket takes a beautiful 225 Yamaha V6 fuel injection and elevates it so it can be set back several feet and run in shallower water where the water runs back to its own level. So this would be great to run through uh, tidal and bay waters where you may get sandbars and shallow water. It does have a stainless steel four blade prop, so that 225 is going to hook up and have great performance on this boat. I like the fact that it's uh, fuel injected so it's turnkey starting, but these are automatic oil injected, it takes the fuss out of it. It is a powerful two stroke, which keeps it a very light 225 for the big engine that it is. We're gonna take a trip on board here and show you around. You'll notice a key feature of the inside of the cockpit is a large wide open floor area. This is exceptional. You can stand up against the transom, against the sides, there's good freeboard. Would give room for easy carry on coolers. If you wanna put a cooler in here with a seat top, or if you want additional fishing chairs, there's plenty of room for it. For 20 foot, this boat has an extended cockpit due to the fact that the engines push back on the transom with a safe high inboard transom and the outboard bracket, you know following seas will never be a problem. This boat does have uh, onboard uh, fuel water separator. It does have the oil injection tank to port back here. Another small storage box up top. Front and rear dual tanks. So this boat gives you extended cruising range. There's at least a 60 gallon capacity. The rear tank alone is 29 gallons. An in-floor uh, fish well with a live well pump, this would allow you to uh, either keep your fish, keep your bait fresh. Of course, this comes with some bumpers, anchor. Up forward in the cabin, there's a stainless steel dive ladder. So over the side would be easy. There is a cover with this boat. You have the uh, center area open in case you want to add a porta potty, but it's a nice padded V berth area. And of course, this has a sliding hatch. So the hatch can slide forward for easy exit on deck or come back to enclose and cover up the cabin. Wellcraft is known for that. They do a really good job. VHF radios hidden in the cabin for emergencies. This was just upgraded with the Lowrance Elite 7. So you've got the, the, the latest in fish finding and GPS technology. There are all of your gauges across the dash and in particular 521.9 hours. So 521.9 is the hours on the engine and this rig. Um, of course you're getting stainless steel hydraulic steering. It has uh, room for outrigger poles if ever added. I like the fact the hydraulic steering will make this boat effortless to steer, dock, and handle at higher speeds. And uh, here at Lancaster County Marine we've gone over and trade checked this boat so you know you're gonna have insurance of good quality and reliability, and uh, you won't be breaking the bank buying this as a saltwater fishing machine. Uh, when you look at what's out there today, there are a few boats that offer the function of this short, small cuddy, which the Wellcraft does very well, and with a much bigger cockpit of boats probably in the 23-foot category to get this much fishing space in the stern. So give us a call here at Lancaster County Marine at 717-859-1121. Look this boat up on our website. 
But uh, call us with any questions, we'd be glad to get you on the water. Thanks for your time.